We think this is a, a propaganda piece uh, designed to push a particular discredited narrative. UK's national broadcaster BBC has quoted serious condemnation from all over for streaming a two-part documentary on Prime Minister Narendra Modi. The series is based on 2002 Gujarat riots during the tenure of Narendra Modi as Chief Minister. Indian External Affairs Ministry termed it a propaganda piece. Official spokesperson of the External Affairs Ministry Arindam Bakchi said the bias, lack of objectivity and continuing colonial mindset are blatantly visible in the documentary. Um, the bias, a lack of objectivity and frankly a continuing colonial mindset is blatantly visible. If anything, uh, this film or documentary is a reflection on the agency and individuals that are peddling uh, this narrative again. Uh, it makes us wonder whether um, about the purpose of this exercise and the agenda behind it. And frankly, we do not wish to dignify such efforts. The controversial documentary has triggered scathing reaction not only from India, but also abroad. UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak also came out in support of PM Modi in the British Parliament after the issue was raised in the Parliament by Park Origin MP Imran Hussain. Rishi Sunak said he doesn't agree with the characterization painted in the documentary. Social media giants including YouTube, Twitter have removed the series video from their platforms. Starting from retired judges, ex-bureaucrats to army veterans, almost all noted personalities in India have raised voice over British broadcasters' anti-Modi rhetoric. More than 300 people signed an open letter criticizing the BBC's documentary. Professor Veena Sikri said BBC has wholly destroyed its credibility. Ex-diplomat Baswati Mukherjee said BBC appears to have colonial mindset for India. The BBC की थोड़ी सी जो इधर उधर लोग सुनते थे बड़े थोड़े और जो credibility वो बिल्कुल खत्म हो गई है। अब लोग नहीं चाहते कि वो BBC का नाम भी सुने। वो नहीं चाहते क्योंकि देख रहे हैं कि BBC के जो 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 opinions हैं कि जो उनके जो मकसद हैं वो कुछ और ही हैं। वो नहीं ना तो वो भारत और यूके के बीच कुछ किसी तरह के फ्रेंडशिप चाहते हैं ना ना तो वो देखना चाहते हैं कि भारत भारत में आज इंटरनल सिचुएशन कैसी है कितनी सक्सेसफुल है भारत की इकोनॉमी इतनी उभर के आ रही है वेल एज यू नो द बीबीसी हैज अ ट्रबल रिकॉर्ड इन डीलिंग विद इंडिया बिकॉज़ इट अपीयर्स टू हैव अ कॉलोनियल माइंडसेट विद रिगार्ड टू इंडिया एंड फ्रॉम टाइम टू टाइम दिस सरफेसेस एंड दिस पर्टिकुलर डॉक्यूमेंट्री ऑफ टू पार्ट्स was a visible example of the fact that although it's a public broadcasting service, it does these programs which are highly discriminatory, interference in our internal affairs, and which are funded by private partners, not the British government. It's BBC's ploy to demolish Modi before 2024 polls, said defence expert P.K. Segal. BBC has a very concocted series of जिसका केवल और केवल इसी मकसद है कि 2024 के इलेक्शन से पहले किसी न किसी तरीके से मोदी को बर्बाद किया जाए। ब्यूरो रिपोर्ट ओटीवी न्यूज़